Do you think Harold is a crooked cop? What would you do in a situation? Pamela, I'm afraid to say I do think he's a little bit crooked, but he is also just, you know, trying to do the right thing. It's a fine line. And what would I do in his situation? I would crawl under my covers with some ice cream and until it all went away. Will Philip Copas and Jean's intense bond be rekindled in season two? Hi, Francesca. Thank you for noticing the sizzling chemistry between Philip and Jean. Uh, they do meet again in season two, but I don't want to give away any secrets. You'll have to watch and find out. How do you stand being in the same room as Jason Momoa and not just burst into flames? Sarah, I can't spend like too long looking at him. Otherwise, I will, in fact, burst into flames. So. It's happened to a couple of people here. It's very, very sad. I'm actually not joking. He's hot as hell. I've never seen anything like it. And now I'm blushing, so that's the full answer. <laughs> How did you prepare to play a character suffering with mental illness? Carrie. I did a lot of reading about schizophrenia. One of the things that I learned is that it looks different on everyone. So um, I took some comfort in that, that you don't, there's not a checklist of things to do to play a schizophrenic. You're from Massachusetts. Can you give us your best Boston accent? Jared, yeah, I can give you a Boston accent. Come to my house, I'll drive you around in my car, and we can like go eat burgers and drink beers and come on. If you could play any other character on the show, who would you pick? Elizabeth, I would play Copas. Come on, who's, who's more fun to play?